Hello everybody and welcome back to Pokemon Leaf Green! Today, we attempt the Pokemon League Challenge. Your arm will face the Elite Four one by one. If we win, a door opens to the next trainer. Once we come in, there's no turning back. Huh. <sighs> This is I'm starting the party. I'm starting with Mark because we will be starting with something Mark should be pretty good against. That being, welcome to the Pokemon League. I'm Lorelai of the Elite Four. No one can be best me when it comes to icy Pokemon. Freezing moves are powerful. Your Pokemon will be at my mercy when they're all frozen solid. <laughs> are you ready? Yes, she has ice types. And well, Steel and Fighting both are super effective against that. Steel, however, is resisted by water, so we're going to be predominantly using the fighting move of Brick Break. Let's do this, Mark. I have very little faith in Mark, which is also why I'm leading with him. Um, not to be rude to Mark or anything, but he's not very fast. He's not very strong. But you don't want to ask what that tongue can do unless you're prepared for the results. Um. Okay, Mark actually might make it through the dugong at least. <laughs> I mean, given there is a level disadvantage going on here, that's not a, you know, it's not a diss on Mark. Like, I mean, it's not a big level disadvantage, but. Mark is still pretty slow. Hey, we managed to bait out one of her full restores. That's actually something I was kind of hoping to do, so... If Mark could score a critical, that would be pretty cool. Um... I can probably take... I'm trying to think. Um, I can probably take another. Hail. That's kind of annoying. That's gonna hurt me over time. That'll basically counteract my leftovers. So I can only really take one more move before I need to heal. Come on, Mark. Critical hit. You know you want to, Mark. Darn it. Um, and yeah, hail happens before the leftover recovery, I'm pretty sure, so, yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, Mark can't take any more hits. Um, Chansey. Call that an attack? I call that an annoyance. <laughs> the egg. Thunderbolt! I was kind of hoping to not have to deal with that anymore, but okay. Well, Mark, you did good. Cloister! Cloister has a lot of physical defense, not much special defense. I wanted to make this switch anyway. Uh, Hail does also power up the power of ice type attacks. Really? You're just gonna protect? It's not like you have me toxic. Or toxic did. It's not like you have me under toxic. I can word. Uh, spikes. Those could be a real problem. Maybe. Okay, the hail has stopped, so that's good. 
Why? <laughs> Why are you doing this? This makes no sense. You're just burning turns of the safeguard. Which is gonna make it all that much more likely I manage a status ailment on you. Yeah, see, it's gone now. One layer of spikes and just protect it a lot. That's all this cloister has done. Does all it have is spikes and protect? Like, what? <laughs> Honestly, I wouldn't be surprised, but... No, that would be if this was actually, like, Gen 1. Slowbro! Um, I really have no reason not to just Thunderbolt. So... I mean, I have the chance for... Oh, no. Well, its special defense is now higher than its physical defense, but... I have the chance for paralysis, so... Yeah, I mean, that kind of hurt, but nowhere's near enough to actually be a threat to Chansey, so... I'm just worried about Thunderbolt PP, but this is what Ethers are for. That's kind of rude. Not gonna lie. She probably does have, like, a dedicated, like, full heal as well. So if I do inflict paralysis, I expect she'll probably heal it off, but... I have four Thunderbolts left. Ooh, I'm definitely gonna have to use some ethers throughout here. Critical hit. That's even more rude. You put me to sleep and then you crit at me. This is this just rude. Come on, Chansey. There we go. And she returned the favor. <laughs> and got the paralysis. Okay. Um, I am going to use Psychic here, because it should finish it off if they- if Lorelei doesn't heal the Slowbro. Okay. Yeah. And if she did heal it, there's a chance of lowering special defense. So... Or was it special attack? Either way, it had a chance of lowering a stat, so... Lapras. Okay, this is her ace. I'm pretty positive it has Body Slam. So, I want to switch. Let's... Oh, the spikes, though. Um... If this is Gen 1, if it has the Gen 1 moveset, it has Body Slam, Ice Beam, Confuse Ray, and a Water move. What was the Water move? I think it might be Surf. Watch me be remembering a completely different Lapras' moveset. Yeah, there's the Body Slam. Knew you had it. Rude. Parafusion. Yeah, okay, I... This has Gen 1 moveset. I thought I'm remembering the Gen 3 moveset. Huh, <sighs> I have like a one-third chance to actually attack. And hey, Wigglytuff did it. Wigglytuff might go down, though. I have a pretty good chance of hitting myself. Okay, I didn't. Uh, do I heal? I could probably finish this encounter up by switching. And she only has one Pokemon left. It feels cheesy to heal at this point. Um, I could go into Slowbro. Slowbro could probably handle things. Or Clefable. Let's go Clefable. I 
if you get the paralysis again, I swear. Okay, good. Um... That's secret power. Yeah, how do you like it? Ah, you're going for the Confuse Ray. Yeah, let's just go for another secret power. Of course, Clefable hurts herself. Ugh. I'm gonna go for it. Darn it. I was running out of Pokemon to switch into. I did buy 10 more revives, so I'm not that beat up over this. Um... Given the paralysis... Chansey should be faster. I hope. <sighs> the spikes. You jerk. Here I am, not using items because I thought you were out. And it felt cheesy. <sighs> I should have known. Um... Ow. Let's fire off a psychic. Why? Why would you do that? Really? You're getting two critical hits that quick. Game. You know what? I'm done playing nice. I am done playing nice. Hey, Slowbro, have your health back. And now the paralysis. I mean, at least that's a 30% chance, but... And now the paralysis. Okay. No, sorry, Chansey. You don't need light screen. Um, I have nothing on here that's effective. This would be a point where if Mark still had stats, it'd be nice. Um, well, HP would be nice. So let me, uh, let me fix that really quick. I mean, I don't think the Jinx has anything effective against Slowbro either. You know, let's just see how much a Surf gets me. Oh right, ice doesn't resist water. I'm dumb. I probably can't take this ice punch though. Oh no. And it's over. I'm so used to ice types also being water. Things shouldn't be this way. Why not? Chansey, you can't evolve. Chansey. It, you can't do it yet. You're not allowed. You're better than I thought. Go on ahead. 
I'm like a taste of the Pokemon League's power. I have... I do need to recover, though. Um... So, let's do that really quick. Get Slowbro nicely healed up. Chansey's good. Chansey's down so little, it really doesn't matter. Get these paralysis cured up. And then we gotta get, uh... Wigglytuff revived. Which I do have 20 revives, I also have the two full revives, so... Now, for this next encounter... We have a fighting type. So, um... Yeah. I don't think Bruno has literally anything that can stand up to either Venusaur or Slowbro. So you know what? Let's use Venusaur, actually. Why not? Let's do this. I am Bruno of the Elite Four. Through rigorous training, people and Pokémon can become stronger without limit. I've lived and trained my fighting Pokémon, and that will never change. Steven! We will grind you down with our superior power. Hoo-ha! Superior power. What are you gonna lead off with, my man? Ah, yes. The Pokemon that is equally as strong as multiple babies. Razor Leaf. Superior power, huh? Hmm. Can't say I'm seeing it. Where, where is this power you speak of? Oh man, I hit Monchan. Um... It's asleep now. <laughs> Let's leech seed it. I'm actually a little surprised I'm going first, but I'll take it. I thought Hitmonchan was faster than that, but... I uh, woke up, did it. Oh, well, now I may not be going first, because he's going to lower my speed. It's kind of rude. Not going to lie, that is kind of rude. I'm still not worried, though. Because, like... <laughs> He'd be better off just continuing to use Rock Tomb. <laughs> oh, man. It's a real shame. <laughs> it's a real shame you did that that exact turn. <laughs> Welcome to how Venusaur plays. Um, when I mentioned way back that Venusaur was bulky, I meant it. Um, Venusaur's bulk does come from healing, but, you know, works out. Hey, you want to, like, full restore again? That'd be really funny. No? Oh, yeah. Next. <laughs> it's Mon Lee. Uh, I'm just gonna go straight for the Leech Seed. Ooh, Mega Kick. It actually has something that'll be effective against me. And it got a critical hit! Of course it did! Why wouldn't it? You know, man, you've used a potion, I'm using one. You can't stop me. 
I don't know how much it'll matter, but... I want to see how much it'll matter. Oh, he's using facade now. Okay, so don't burn this thing. Or poison it. Or paralyze it. Though so paralyzing it, maybe... Um, should be limber, so you wouldn't be able to paralyze it anyway. But... Putting it to sleep's fine. Because it probably doesn't have sleep talk. Uh... <laughs> Uh, Facade is a move that deals more damage if you have a status condition. It doesn't counteract burn, so that's only really a thing on, like, Guts Pokemon. But, it does still increase in power, so burning it doesn't do a, whole, a huge amount. If it uses Facade too much. Want full restore again? No? Okay. Okay, I, yeah, I lived that above half. What's next? Another Onyx, eh? Oh, it's actually faster than me. That's a problem. Or not. I kind of expected that to deal a little more damage. <laughs> Just kind of. Now we got my champ. My champ. Okay. Um Will I be faster? Let's see. Nope. And you got a crit. Fine. Come here, slow bro. So I might have actually lived that. I don't know. But one thing's for one thing is for certain. Slowbro ain't losing this. <laughs> Another crit, really? It's pretty rude to crit three times. Why? How could I lose? Um, because you're using two Onyx. My job is done. Go face your next challenge. No, he turns away. Poor guy. I should revive first. That way I can do both healings at the same time. Okay. Now, next should be Agatha, the Ghost Trainer. So in other words, I should still just be using Slowbro. Um, but I want to do things a little more interestingly than that. Clefable hasn't got to do a huge amount yet, so let's get Clefable into the front. Got a lot of 49s now, and 148! Clefable is the 48. Um... So, basically, this will just be Clefable Slowbro. Hi, I'm Agatha of the Elite Four. I hear Oak's taken a lot of interest in you, child. That old duff was once tough and handsome. But that was decades ago. He's a shadow of his former self. Now he just wants to fiddle with his Pokedex. He's wrong. Pokemon are for battling. Steven, I'll show you how a real trainer battles! Will you, though? Gengar! Ah, starting off strong, I see. Well, uh, I kind of am too. Yeah, she's a bit of an evasion noob. Uh, would not be surprised if this Gengar just has nothing it can actually do to Clefable. Come on, Clefable. Please, just... 
We'll just deal with this thing. That dealt almost nothing. Oh no, it has toxic. <laughs> That's annoying. Critical hit? No, she, okay, she's gonna heal. I'm gonna wait to heal. I will do it. I'll probably use actually. I'll probably actually use a full restore this time, but I'm not full restoring for like 10 HP. Ugh. Double team. Critical hit. No. I need to be mindful of my HP. I need to heal after this next Shadow Ball. Regardless if it hits or not. Because I can't take two more ticks of poison. Because yeah, the next tick of poison would KO me, so. Full restore. Watch what she uses toxic again right away. Now, nah, just more double team. Which means she's going to get the Toxic back on me, but... Or she's going for Confuse Ray. Maybe I'll luck out? I wonder what my actual odds are of, like, getting through the Confusion and landing the Shadow Ball are. Especially now, because I think she's at max evasion. Ugh, Agatha, please. Actually, fight me. Jesus. No. Okay, she wasn't at max. Now I think she is. Ah, that's right, you missed. How's it feel? Got just a misfest going on out here. Yeah, I'm confused. Confused why you're not fighting me. Um, I'm gonna eat through all of my Shadow Balls here. This is immensely annoying. Like, uh, this is why I don't use evasion moves. Like, this just feels cheap. There is absolutely nothing I can do here, other than just keep spamming and hoping. Oh, I'm out of confusion. Hey, I landed a move. Hopefully that's enough. Thank you. Uh, uh. You know what? I'm done being nice. Oh, it is air cutter. That could be annoying. Or the quick claw could come into play. <laughs> I think Slowbro is right here with me. Okay, she's probably gonna heal. Or not. I just wanted to get a little damage. Without using another psychic. Arbok. Um, let's just throw a Surf out here. Quick Claw! I wish it told you when the Quick Claw was coming into play, but I'm fairly confident that was the Quick Claw coming into play. Wow, got the poison. You know, I'll keep regular poisoning. I don't know if she has any more toxic Pokémon, though. Um... Ah, I, don't, I feel cheap using so many items. Um... Uh, 
Oh, that dealt quite a lot. And it's faster than me. Okay, that's a bit of a problem. I mean, her Arbok is actually to the point where it can actually do something, so it has that going for it. Uh, when this thing gets low enough, she's probably going to use a healing move, like a healing item on it. So... Um... Eh, I'll heal. Okay, let's see. Of course, why wouldn't the AI get a crit? Why wouldn't it? It's only gotten a crit in every single encounter so far. She's gonna heal. Or not. Okay, what is she saving it for? Gengar. Okay. Wow. Landed the 55 accuracy, huh? I think it's 55. Might be 60, but still. That should do next to nothing. Yeah. I mean, for Mark, that's next to nothing. Is that really the only thing this thing has? Come on, Mark. Uh, I don't... I've used two healing items. The game did get a crit. I'm giving myself another healing item. Because the game got a crit. You know what? It's just gonna put me right back to sleep. Because it's faster than Mark. I could, like, full restore Clefable. That's what I'll do. I'm going to full restore Clefable and then just let Mark die and just go into Clefable. I only have five Shadow Balls left because of that first Gengar. This one clearly doesn't have, uh... Double Team, though, so that's good. I'm gonna Cosmic Power. And then I'm gonna heal. Because I don't care. <laughs> it's what items are for. And let's be real, she deserves it. Uh, Max Potion. Because I have a bunch of them. Well, not a bunch, but like, I have them and I would never buy more, so... Oops. So you better miss. Can I have a critical hit? No? Okay, Citrus Berry. She may not heal because of the Citrus Berry. Yeah, she's above healing threshold now. So she's really holding on to that final item for whatever is last. Really? How was that? Okay. Rude. Maybe I can get the confusion here. Nah. I'm just gonna use some water pulses. God damn it. I 
I'd rather not burn through, like, all of my items dealing with you, Agatha. Can you just stop? Agatha is, like, the most annoying of all of the gym leaders. Well, Elite Four members. Yeah, gym leaders. Like, not only does she have the... Really? Really? Game, can you give yourself a normal critical hit ratio? I have critical hit once. Can you give yourself a normal accuracy, too? Gods! Just screw off with the- That's a ghost move. How does that even hit me? That's a ghost type attack. That- That's a ghost move. I should be immune to that. Oh, well... Fine, I'll let Clefable die. The game clearly wants her dead. Gods! Agatha, just die! <laughs> I just pull out a gun and shoot her and be done with it. Like, Jesus. Uh... I need a Pokemon that's just immune to sleep. That'd be pretty neat. That's a ghost move. That shouldn't be affecting me. I know this is probably a case, so I'm just salty and that normally does affect, but still... Come on, Wigglytuff, thank you. Get the burn, please. No, of course not. You know, you could miss a hypnosis. You've missed like twice. Hit every other time. On a move with like 60 accuracy. If I was using hypnosis, it might be it might work the other way around. I might get like one or two hits. And the rest would be misses. You know, like it's supposed to be. Thank you. Gods, I am so done with Agatha. And I gave you a voice in everything, Agatha. And this is how you repay me. By being the most obnoxious trainer yet. Oh, dear God. You better not land any of those. Like, I get, Hypnosis is technically more- has a higher chance of hitting than missing. But come on now. We all know... ...how just... ...BS this is, right? No. I am so close to cursing. <laughs> it is unreal. If that is her only offensive move... It'll do basically nothing to Slowbro. Who might even be able to just one-shot this thing with a... Psychic, so... Come on, kill Wigglytuff. 
It's not like this has been hard. It's just the game has obviously been cheating. Like, I'm sorry, the odds of what Agatha has been doing are so stupidly improbable. I'm going to have to count in editing how many hypnosis she landed. Because it has almost certainly been more than 60% of them. Great, now Slowbro, wake up and kill it. Oh. God damn it. Just wake up. Come on. Thank you. Gods. I apologize, I'm getting so frustrated here, but I don't think I can be blamed. Agatha, go jump off a cliff. Good God. Don't care, shut up. I have nothing to say to you, old lady. Go fall in a grave already. Gods. I apologize, I'm so salty. I'm gonna need a break between this episode and the next one, because Jesus Christ. I should not be needing this many items right now. There- I refuse to believe what Agatha did was actually statistically probable. The game does cheat. I refuse to believe it doesn't. Like... <laughs> I honestly can't wait for the day we have a Pokemon game that doesn't cheat. Because they all do. It's frustrating. As you can tell. It'd be really nice if the game had to play by the same rules I do. But, you know, it doesn't. I swear if I now don't even have the items to make it through the rest of this. Uh, I had a couple citrus berries, right? Because I only need a little bit of healing. It's 30. That's about what I need. Okay. That's going to be it for today. Thank you all very much for watching. Again, I apologize I got so frustrated. Hopefully I'll see you back here tomorrow as we continue through the Elite Four where we will almost certainly not have to deal with anywhere near as much frustration. Because Agatha is just really the only BS trainer here. So, see you next time.